Hello and you're very welcome to this video. In this lesson, we're going to learn about how to find the value of sine, cos or tan of a number using our calculators. So let's get stuck into it, folks. I'm using here a Casio uh, scientific calculator. So what I do is I type into my calculator. I first thing I type in is sine, S-I-N there, which is there it is in your calculator. And then I type in the angle that we're looking for. So in this question here, I'm looking for sine 58. So I'm going to type in 58, 5, 8. That's it, just those three buttons. I then press the equals and the calculator will show me an answer then. It'll be a long decimal answer of 0 0.8480 and lots and lots of numbers thereafter. Now, this question here is asking us to find the value to correct it to decimal places, which would be fairly standard in most of the questions you do. So let's round that off to two decimal places then. So that becomes 0 0.8. Well, let's have a look here then at my two numbers here. So my second number is four, but my third number is eight. And we know we round up then if the number is five or more, we round up. So because the number eight is bigger than five, I'm going to increase my second number there, four to five. So this becomes 0 0.85. And that's how you find sine 58. If I'm asked to find cos, uh, cosine or cos of a number, it's the same process. I type cos first and then I type in whatever the number is. And if I'm asked to find the tan of a number, I type in tan and then the number instead and press equals. That's all for this video, folks. If you have any questions, ask below in the comments. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like and of course, subscribe to the channel. Thanks very much for watching. Bye now.